हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड मॉर्निंग आई होप यू ऑल आर वेरी फाइन एंड एंजॉइंग योर स्टडी वेलकम टू इंग्लिश क्लास टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू फाइंड आउट फिगर ऑफ स्पीच एंड राइम स्कीम इन अ पोएम अ टाइगर इन द जो सो लेट्स फाइंड आउट फर्स्ट स्टेंजा ही स्टॉक्स इन हिज विविड स्टेप द फ्यू स्टेप्स ऑफ हिज केज ऑन पेड्स ऑफ वेलवेट क्वाइट इन हिज क्वाइट रेंज सो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस स्टेंजा ही इज यूज फॉर टाइगर so the whole stanza is written in personification figure of speech in first line stock strips these words have a sound so alliteration is used here again stocks his strips these words have a sound so consonants figure of speech is used here again in his vivid strips these words have i sound so insonance figure of speech is used here and in third line on pads of velvet quiet pads of velvet these words are compared so metaphor figure of speech is used here in fourth line in his quiet rage these words are opposite so oxymoron figure of speech is used here in second stanza he should be lurking in shadow sliding through long grass near the water hole where plump deer pass in this stanza he is also used for tiger so the whole stanza is written in personification figure of speech in first line should shadow as sound is repeated here so alliteration figure of speech is used here in third stanza he should be snarling around houses at the jungle's edge bearing his white fangs his claws terrorizing the village again he is used for tiger so the whole stanza is written in personification figure of speech in first line should snarling as sound is repeated so alliteration figure of speech is used here and again snarling snarling means sound of tiger so onomatopoeia figure of speech used here in third line his white fangs his claws his word is repeated here so repetition figure of speech is used here in fourth line terrorizing the village this line has exclamation mark so exclamation figure of speech used here but he is locked in a concrete cell he is stand behind bars stalking the length of his cage ignoring visitor so students he is again used for tiger so the whole stanza is written in personification figure of speech in first line concrete cell c sound c sound is repeated so alliteration is used here in second line behind bar b sound is repeated so alliteration figure of speech is used here in last stanza he hears the last voice at night the patrolling car and stares with his brilliant eyes at the brilliant stars he is used here for tiger so the whole stanza is written personification figure of speech patrolling car patrolling car in these words transferred epithet figure of speech is used here in third and fourth line brilliant brilliant eyes brilliant stars here transferred epithet figure of speech is used here so student these are your figure of speech now rhyme scheme first stanza in first line provide a in second line because there is no common rhyming word so b on pads of velvet quiet in this line there is no common rhyming word so c in his quiet rage then second and fourth line cage and rage have same sound so b so rhyme scheme 
ए बी सी बी सो स्टूडेंट द होल पोएम इज रिटर्न इन द सेम राइम स्कीम ए बी सी बी सो स्टूडेंट पोइट्रिक डिवाइस द फर्स्ट लाइन ही स्टॉक्स इन हीज विविड स्टेप्स द फिव स्टेप्स ऑफ हीज केज द स्टूडेंट फर्स्ट लाइन डजेंट हैव एनी पंक्चुएसन सो एम एंजॉयमेंट एंजॉयमेंट फिगर पोइट्रिक डिवाइस इज यूज हेयर सो स्टूडेंट द पोएम इज यूज द पोएम इज कम्प्लीटेड बाई मी एंड आव इट्स योर टर्न टू रीड एंड प्रिपेयर इट थैंक यू